Hey Silas, it's Logan at Perkins Motorplex in Mayfield. Gonna walk around this awesome F-150 Lariat with the 5.0 V8 in it. Um, FX4 package, really nice Nitto Ridge Grappler tires uh, and a leveling kit. Man, I think this truck is uh, awesome. Uh, gonna point out anything I see on it as far as dings and scratches go. Uh, obviously, all of our vehicles are used, so we don't expect them to be perfect. Uh, I like to say they all get grace uh, because we are selling used cars, pre-owned stuff. But uh, this one, you know, when the mileage is this good and it's fairly new like this, uh, we expect it to be really, really nice. And this one is the wheels. All four wheels are in good shape. And those are brand new tires, of course, a high dollar scent. It's got a spray in bed liner. Uh, one bit of uh, weathering I did see on the truck is this tailgate, the exit of the tailgate. Uh, not sure if you can see that. Just a couple little spots there. Uh, certainly doesn't affect the functionality of it. Of course, you got the uh, the knee saver step there, uh, the handle. Uh, but just some scratching on the back side of that tailgate. Uh, it is a truck, you know, it's been used uh, obviously by somebody as a truck. Sliding things in and out, uh, probably got a few scratches and stuff on it. So, so there's that. Uh, it's kind of hard to put that uh, um, step in one handed while you're filming, so I'll just leave it down for now. Uh, but it does have the parking sensors. Uh, back bumper looks good. There's a couple little spots right there that have been touched up, but that's me being pretty picky with it. Uh, back bumper as a whole is great. A receiver, everything in there looks good. Okay. Uh, on the passenger side, there is one spot, one ding right in the middle of the door there, kind of a little bit of a crease there. Uh, let's see if I can help you. There is the width of the crease right there. Other than that, it's great. And perhaps a dent specialist could make that crease a little bit better. Um, now this truck was on a test drive the other day, uh, so it does have a few bugs and stuff on the front. But all in all, this black grill is in great shape. Uh, I don't see any hail damage or dings like that on the roof or the hood, either one. A little bit of corrosion on that, on that tow hook right there. And speaking of that, let's go ahead and look underneath the frame and just check this out. Nice through there, a little bit of surface rust. Oh yeah, nice and clean. So we do this under spray on all of our vehicles that you see there, uh, whether it's a Nissan Altima or a big truck, we're gonna do that under spray on all of them. But I always tell people rust is rust, rust is rust and corrosion is corrosion. So no matter what color it is, you're gonna see that main frame line really flaking and starting to peel. And if that's starting to flake and peel, then that means you got issues in other places too and that main line is really really good nice and smooth there so i like that so you're gonna see a little bit on there but nothing nothing excessive by any means making our way to the inside i noticed the back seat on this side has a little bit of uh discoloring but it's just these little uh perforated spots we can actually we've actually got a specialist that uh he works on seats and stuff for us he can actually get those out uh really easily but uh truck smells good no smoke smell no animal smell rear heated seats seat backs look good i mean this truck's beautiful inside and out bang and olufsen sound system i like the chocolate accent with the black and gray driver's seat looks great no floor mats. A lot of guys are, are chucking the floor mats that come from the factory anyway and going to like the weather tech or whatever. Um, it's telling me that the tailgate is open, which of course we left it open. Uh, nice huge touch screen. Of course you got your XM radio, your navigation. Uh, I tell you when Ford went to this operating system, it's a big screen. They're wondering if you know the system would keep up, but you can see just how responsive it is. It is very quick. Uh, you can move it around. It's user-friendly. I don't think it's overly distracting. Uh, I think they knocked it out of the park. Of course, you got the double roof in this truck. 
real nice deep center console. Of course, that lays flat for extra space. Yeah, I am a fan of this truck for sure. Passenger seat looks good. Uh, center console lock right there. And here's that extra storage. Center console key, I should say, is what that was. Man, just beautiful and really, really functional. Of course, heated and cooled seats, heated steering wheel. Got your lane centering on there, which I love. Uh, memory seat, the list goes on and on. This truck is loaded, loaded. There's your tailgate letdown. Let me know what other questions you have. Um, it does have two key fobs and the remote start does work. Uh, so that's great. Use that to start the vehicle. And again, it's, I mean, this thing's a nine out of 10 on the outside and probably a nine out of 10 on the inside. We see certainly when you sell used cars, not all used trucks are created equal. Uh, they're not all this easy to sell. I don't want to oversell it, but just a couple minor things and uh, this thing is ready to roll. Let me know what other questions you have. Uh, as of this video, it's available. There is one credit app in on it, but uh, it is available otherwise.